Hi, Shalom, Shalom. This part two of my video, you know, I was finna just do put both on together, but you know, my video stopped because of the rain. I guess it stopped by itself because I ain't in the video, you feel what I'm saying? So it's finna get into like Lamentation chapter five. When you keep reading on, it says, um, Remember, O Lord, what it what come upon us, consider and behold our approach. Our, our inheritance is turned to strangers, our houses to aliens. So that was going into the time, you know, when talking about Jerusalem, when when our people um land when their homeland was turned into strangers and our um houses to aliens, right? And it says, cause you know, that's when you know the other nations had came in and kicked us out our homeland. That's really what the whole book of Lamentations is about, like going into like Jeremiah mourning and crying because, you know, his um you know, Jerusalem was getting defiled. You know, our people was getting killed, getting raped in that time. So that was Jeremiah was really talking about. So when they said, right, our inheritance is turned to strangers, that when other nations came in the homeland, took over it, you know, they kind of kind of turned it into their homeland, defiled our stuff, and uh, you feel what I'm saying? And it says, it says, we are orphans. It said, we are orphans and fatherless. And this was going on right now. This fit the curses, man. This is the curses. This is like Deuteronomy 28 and 54. It said, we are orphans and fatherless. Our mothers are as widows. That's how, that's how we know this is talking about us, man, because we fit in this thing right now. And it says, we have, I'm going to stop at verse 8, too. It says, we have drunken our water for money, and our wood is sold unto us. What we got, what we doing now? Back then, that's, you know what I'm saying? You had to pay for that. But guess what? When, when it says, I, I hear it to the, the strangers, so now the strangers are ruling over us. Even this time, you know, the so-called white man is ruling over us now in, in so-called well, so America, which is Babylon the Great. And we have to pay for water now. Water that freely falls from the sky, we have to pay for it now. And this is what was going on, you know what I'm saying? Back when Jeremiah wrote Limitations, he said, We have drunken our water from money, and our wood is sold to us. So we know we got to get wood sold to us, man. We got to go to the hardware store, you know, you got to go to uh, all these places that sell wood and stuff to get your wood. You know, they sell it, you, they sell it to you, right? So, like it. the train they that's Satan man <laughs> Bear with me, bear with me. Train kind of came out of nowhere, man. I'm trying to wait till it stops. keep the video going man that's taking too long right and it says lord willing y'all can hear me it says our necks it says our necks are under persecution we labor and have no rest so our necks are under uh, under persecution right and now we see in america man our necks are under persecution you know we stay getting our necks stuck down man look at it literally george floyd literally his neck was literally under persecution literally you know what I'm saying? So we know that our people are fitting these, uh, you know, they're talking about our people in today's time. We labor and have no rest. We labor, man. Might got to work two or three jobs, maybe even four jobs to try to pay your rent. Then you got to continue, you know what I'm saying? Wake up to five in the morning and do the same thing. You won't get no rest, man. You working your ass off, but you ain't getting no rest. You know? And it says, we have given the hand. It says, we have given the hand to the Egyptians and to the Syrians to be satisfied with bread. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it says, and they, these are the other um, heathen nations, right? The Syrians and the uh, and Egyptians are the heathen uh, nations. And it says, our fathers have sinned and are not, and we have borne their iniquities. So we born our fathers' iniquities. Even to this day, we still doing that. You know, our forefathers went off into idolatry, adultery, you know, witchcraft, all type of stuff. So we paying for their iniquities right now. Even to this day, we still in captivity because of what our forefathers did. You know, and it says, servants. Servants have ruled over us, 
and there is none that does deliver us out of their hands. So the servants, the people, the, the, the other nations that were made to be servants, they rule over us now, man. They are literally rule, ruling over us right now because we didn't know we was going off. You know, that's how we know that the other nations are servants. They're under us, man. So we're not equal because it's tell you that they, they, they ruling over us now. So if they wasn't ruling over us before, what they was doing? They were being servants and handmaids. You feel what I'm saying? So... This really, I just want to make a video on this because Lamentations is a beautiful book. And we fit in this stuff like right now. We seeing what Jeremiah was seeing. We going through what Jeremiah was going through at that specific moment. You know what I'm saying? That's how we know this Bible is about us. And it's, it's, it's real. You know, it's, it's a book of life. You feel what I'm saying? You know, so this but the king. I want to give all honor and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah. And I say Shalom.